Over the past six decades, we've seen the birth and rise of the video game. The video game industry is huge. With video game software and hardware sales skyrocketing, gaming has created its own subculture. Several advancements have been made over the recent years. Games are becoming more and more realistic with not only their graphics, but their gameplay as well. Physics engines have played a major role in making the gameplay more realistic. Physics engines are libraries of code that perform approximate simulations of physical systems. There are two types of physics engines, high-precision engines and real-time engines. High-precision engines require more processing power, so they are used more for scientific modeling rather than video games. The physics engines found in video games are real-time engines, meaning the simulations are performed at a rate appropriate for gameplay. Real-time physics engines are the focus of our presentation as they are what are driving the realism in the video game industry today. Physics engines can bring realism to several aspects in a video game, including environmental destruction and stimulus, secondary motion, body dynamics, audio, and other gameplay features. There is a growing demand for realistic gameplay, but this demand calls for more than just high-quality graphics. Players now expect real-world logic involved in their gaming. Forces like gravity and friction must be accounted for. Other expectations include realistic collisions, damage, and character movements. To answer these demands, developers must balance technological constraints with expectations. Processing speed is a major consideration. Players do not want their gaming experience interrupted for processing purposes, but they expect certain levels of realism. Different approaches have been taken with various hardware, middleware, and software systems in play. Some engines process the physics calculations needed using a dedicated graphics accelerator such as a GPU, while others rely on the central processing unit, or CPU. The video game physics engine sector is dominated by two major players, Havoc and NVIDIA. But there are other players who have built physics into their game engines. There are also open source options, but they are not within the scope of this presentation. In this presentation, we will outline the general history of video games and the industry as it is pertinent to physics engines. We will then discuss the current trends in use of physics in video games, and finally, we will explore the current industry landscape and state of physics engines. Now, Chelsea will discuss video game history.